everyone welcome back to anxiety art adventures today I'm going to show you three different items that I have purchased over the last few weeks um, kind of random things but I wanted to go ahead and show them to you uh, the first thing I'm going to show you is a new wax that I was actually I had no idea it was out there um, my good friend and subscriber and patreon uh, Alicia Fortes messaged me and said have you tried this wax yet I said no, what wax? What are you talking about, sugar? Um, because for the last two weeks, I have been um, <laughs> basically in my own little world and not been on social media much or uh, YouTube uh, due to my new kittens, which they're doing fabulous. Um, they're, I'm tired, y'all. <laughs> I'm really tired. But um, everything's going good on that front. So anyway, super excited to try this new wax. It's from Metalheads DP. Uh, they are a company uh, on Etsy, and I'm excited because they are actually in Virginia. I live in Virginia, and they are from Williamsburg, Virginia, which is only about 30 minutes from me. Uh, so that was really cool. I was like, yay, Virginia, woo. Um, anyway, so they sent me, I ordered five uh, different scents, and they sent me a sample. Now, the sample they sent me was strawberry, and I tried this last night on my... Um, Luna Moth DP that I'm slowly working on and um, it's it's not bad it's pretty much the same consistency as patty wax it's a very uh, very hard uh, dense wax um, it stayed in my pen fine I didn't have a lot of residual and um, I used it for probably about I DP last night for about 30, 45 minutes, and it was I was still able to pick up drills at the end of that. I don't count drills, so no show, no. Um, so it was still workable um, at the end of my uh, diamond painting session there. So yeah, so this was strawberry. That was the sample they sent. Um, I haven't opened these yet. Hi, Chew. Strawberry. Woo! Okay. We're going to take these out. Now, these are in really nice. Um, I like that it came in a bubble wrap bag. That's really nice. Okay, now, these are in nice screw top containers. Uh, this one is Bahama Breeze. Um, and they're just, you know, they're in a container. Mmm, love it. Now, the one thing I'll tell you about these is they are not, this is blood orange. Um, they smell really good, they're, but they're not overpowering. Um, I'm very sensitive to smell. Cucumber melon, one of my favorite scents ever. Um, I mean, you can definitely smell them, but they're not like you open it and it's like, holy crap, you know. Uh, this one is called Poolside. Oh, that's, that's lovely. Just very subtle. Um, yeah, this one's called Unicorn in a Blender. And I'm, I'm trying to figure out what this smells like. I can't, I can't figure out. It, it almost smells like, like sweet tarts, kind of. Kind of smells like sweet tarts. <laughs> but anyway, so uh, these are very nice. These are 10 gram containers. And each one of these is $5.49. And you do need to order, I think it was like $35 worth of product to get free shipping. I did not order that, so I went ahead and paid for the shipping. Because um, I don't I don't need more and more wax. I mean, I wanted to try it, so I went ahead and got different scents. So let me know in the comments below if anybody has tried Metalheads, DPs, uh, wax and according to this it's called that wax so if that if that helps um, let me know if any of you have tried this wax what you think of it um, you know do you want to get it that kind of thing I I don't mind it at all um, it like I said it's like patty wax it's just not as strong of a smell as patty wax um, just my opinion so yeah I'm going to keep the strawberry out because I'm using that on Luna Moth. But yeah, I think you got a decent amount um, 
for $5.49. I think that's, that's pretty good. And I mean, yes, you are still going to have to, um, where's my pen? You are still going to have to like scrape it. But to me, that's easier. I mean, you can do it around. I usually do it like around the edge like that. Um, and then just stick it on a piece of parchment paper. Um, yeah. But make sure you screw them tight because um, they will dry out if you don't screw them on all the way. Um, yeah. I made that mistake. I, I cut um, a sliver of patty wax and put it in a Ziploc bag and apparently I didn't Ziploc the bag all the way. And uh, yeah, it, it dried out. Yikes. It still worked, it just didn't work as well. Okay, so Metalheads DPs. I will have the link down below for their Etsy shop. Go check them out. Um, they do have other items as well. I think I saw some um, diamond painting pens on there as well, so check that out. Okay, so the next thing that I purchased, well, bam, all dashing nails. Now, as you know, uh, Mrs. Coffee, uh, tried these nails out, um, I want to say it was probably a month ago, and really liked them, and I messaged her, or I, I commented on her video on this and said, hey, which one do you like better, the All Dashing or the Color Street, because I'm a Color Street fan, and uh, she said she liked these better for the main reason that you don't have to do anything to them. You don't have to file the excess adhesive, um, you know, you don't have to sit there and try and and, and get it to stick, you know, a piece of sticker on your finger. Um, so these, she said, she liked these better. So I said, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a try. Uh, and she is an affiliate with them. So um, I got a discount code. So if you go check out her, her YouTube channel, she's got a video of the nails and you can access her um, discount code if you wanna try this. So it was buy one, get one half off. So I got, look at, this oh my gosh look at that pretty it's like a grayish blue and like a coral pink oh my goodness yes please okay so I got that one oh look at that it's like a it's like a very pale green and then it's got two designs on there and these are press-on nails. I don't know if I made that clear in the beginning. I'm sorry if I didn't. These are just, you pick which one, you know, fits your finger and you press it on. Um, I have not tried them yet. Look at that. Pretty, like, gray-blue and then sparkle, Shook. Sparkle. Gotta have some sparkle, you know. Um, I have not tried these yet because I broke my thumbnail. <laughs> down to the quick and I'm waiting for it to grow. I need to give it a few more days before I put a nail on. And then this beautiful coral. Uh, they do not have the name of the color on the box. That's the only thing I would recommend is that the company put the name of, um, of the color of the nails on the box. So I don't see them on the box. So that would be my recommendation. Uh, but anyway, so Mrs. Coffee really said that she liked these. So I was like, okay, I'll go ahead and, and give it a shot and support her a little bit. Uh, so anyway, let me know if any of you have tried All Dashing Nails. And if so, what do you think? Um, and for those of you that have used Color Street and then used All Dashing, let me know which one you like better, uh, if you have. Um, and also, which one should I try first? Should I try the glitter, the green floral, the gray and pink, or the coral? You tell me. You decide. Which one? Let me know in the comments below. Wh whichever one gets the most comments, I will put on. And let me know if you want to see a video of me putting them on. Um, I know Mrs. Coffee has a video of that, so... Um, I don't know if you want to see it twice, but anyway, got some nails. Okay. And then the last thing I'm going to show you that I got, I got some new Zox bracelets. 
Okay, so for those of you that are not familiar with Zox, uh, they are a, um, obviously a company. Uh, they have a website and they make these inspirational bracelets and proceeds, some proceeds from the bracelet goes to uh, a very good cause called the Thirst Project, which provides clean water to communities in need uh, all across the country um, and other countries. So I think it's a, a fabulous uh, company and they're doing uh, wonderful, wonderful things um, for people in need of clean water. So I highly recommend if you are interested in um, an inspirational bracelet, go check them out. I will have their uh, website down below. And all of these bracelets are uh, $10. It doesn't matter if you get a skinny one or a wide one. And I forgot to tell you, uh, these are uh, $9.90 each, um, the all dashing nails. And like I said, you can go check out Mrs. Coffee's uh, video and get a discount code. Okay. So, uh, let's open these up. I'm a huge fan of these Zox bracelets. I have, I only have six. Um, and these are $10 each. So this first one is called one day at a time and they provide you a little card um, with an inspirational saying on each one. This one says, we can't change yesterday. We don't know what tomorrow will bring. All that matters is right now. So that's nice. And then this is a, it's a stretchy bracelet. I always order a medium. The ones I have on are medium. I have small wrists um, and I have plenty of room. These are actually almost too big for me, but I think the small would be too small. Um, they recommend the average size is a medium. They're reversible. So on the other side, you have your, your saying. Pretty image, saying. Pretty cool. Again, like I said, they are $10. And they also have keychain, uh, which is really cool. I, I don't carry a keychain, but they have a keychain clamp that goes on like this. So you can make it so you just carry it around and you have your keys on it. Um, I thought that was a pretty nifty nifty thing. All right. Um, I've had a lot of people ask me about the bracelet, so I wanted to go ahead and, and do a show and tell. Perfectly imperfect. Imperfection equals individuality and that equals perfection. On the outside, you've got this really pretty, it's got blues and purples. Then you swap it over and you've got your inspirational message. Whee! Camera. Nope. Camera isn't going to camera today. Yeah. So yeah, I ordered five of these. All right. This one's one of my favorites. You're not alone. Whether it's laughing or crying, we'll do it together. Look at that cool pattern. It's got all my favorite colors, like pink and purple. It's got some green thrown in there. And then on the flip side, you've got the message. You're not alone. Love it. Love it, Shug. These are great. And you can also, like if, if they get dirty, because they're going to get dirty because you're wearing them on your, your wrist over time, um, you can just hand wash them with some mild... Um, mild uh like dish detergent and then just let them let them dry okay this one is a wider band um it's okay to not be okay uh nothing in nature blooms all year long that's good that's good so on the outside it's the real pretty pink flowers and then on the inside it's got your message I just, I love these bracelets. Um, again, I was inspired by Mrs. Coffee because she, she had some on. So I went and checked it out and found out, you know, what Zox does as far as um, the Thirst Project. So I wanted to contribute uh, one step at a time. Give it time, you'll get there. Look at those pretty reds, blues, corals. Awesome. And then you've got the message, one step at a time. So yeah. So those are the items that I have gotten in the last couple of weeks. Um, 
bracelets, wax, and nails. Um, and I've been sitting on them. Uh, the wax, no, the wax just came in recently. But um, I've been sitting on these because I wanted to go ahead and do a video of all of them together. So at least it wasn't just, hey, here's some wax. See you later. <laughs> um, yeah. So anyway, uh, those are the items I got. So let me know in the comments below which nails you, you would like for me to try. Here, I'll show them again. Um, I don't remember what order I had them in. I think it was like that. I don't know. Anyway. Here, let me zoom back out there you go sorry for the glare um yeah glitter green pink coral so yeah i'm excited to try these um i've heard a lot of people say they really like them i'm curious how long they're gonna stay on my fingers because i do a lot of cleaning and especially with um bleach and stuff so I should probably wear gloves so they don't affect these um, and I did get the squared off ones I don't like the pointy ones um, I would absolutely kill myself if I got pointy ones and I'd kill my husband and my dog and my cats no I have to have the squared off ones. so those are the ones I got so anyway uh, let me know in the comments below which one of these you'd like for me to try and again like I said I'll have links to all of these the nails the wax and uh, Zox down below uh, feel free to check them out. I want to thank all my patrons for um, your awesome support. Um, you're the reason that I can bring you things like this to the channel uh, and tell you what I think of them. And I, I just can't thank y'all enough. Um, if you're new to the channel, um, please hit that subscribe button, ring the bell, and uh, that'll let you know whenever I put up a video. And uh, for all of my other subscribers, just thank you for watching my videos. It means the world to me. Y'all are the best. Um, I just, oh, I just, I can't, I can't thank you enough. Love, love all of you. Okay. Uh, I hope everybody has a lovely day and I will see you again really, really soon. Bye guys.